Hello everyone, how's your Sunday? This is Melody and welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for checking and watching my channel. So, just to let everyone know, I had a little boo-boo today. It's a freaky Sunday. Check my community post and you'll know how I got this because I was doing my daily vlog and happy Sunday everyone. I said a prayer or two for you, for everyone today, for your personal intentions, healing, strength, peace, and blessings. Now, I want to um, ask Sperry guys before I'm going to be cleansing myself and go to shower. I want to ask, who is this person who's going to marry you? If you were married before, that doesn't count because that's the past. I want to know in, like what is to come, like the the future or like, you know, what is going to happen. So like I said, if you were someone who's separated, divorced, been married before, that doesn't count because I'm not asking about the past. I'm asking about the present moment and the future. So who is this person? Anything, any information you need to know about this per person who's going to marry you? Okay, who's going to give you your happily ever after? Are they going to treat you right? Is this a wonderful person? Anything else that we need to know, like their personality or anything that Spirit Guys wants to tell us about your future spouse, about your future significant other. So the choice today, we're going to go by color, pile one, purple, pile two, brown, pile three, yellow. Okay, so that's the color that I feel cool. It's different sets of tarot that we're going to use. We're going to use like my handwritten notes and like this fairy angel cards that I have. Okay, let's find out, okay? So pardon me, so try because I need to cover my <laughs> cut so, but I want to do this reading. Let's go calling on my spirit guides, my guardian angel, the assistance of the higher power and the spirit of the universe as we're going to channel messages, possible energies, advice for those who's going to pick pile purple, brown, and yellow. Spirit guides, who is this person who's going to marry pile purple, brown, and yellow? And may they resonate with their pile. Thank you. So, um, let's just see any one, two, three that we need to know. Who is this person who's going to marry you? We're going to do real time, even if I have a band aid, who's going to stop us? But, you know, I, I really feel cold though. And I mean, I mean, I, it's very strong. Look at the fire in our candle. I mean, I felt like Spirit Guy says, okay, let's go. So I'm going to do it. Okay, so Spirit guys, who is this person who's going to marry pile one? Ha! Huh? Someone who's very sexual, very sensual, very attractive, very sexy, very, um, like, you know, very charming. And this person has a lot of admirers. So, you know, if this is a masculine energy, this is someone you're really going to be so addicted to because I feel like this person is like, you know, is good in the bedroom or like is, is a sexual magnet, okay? So this is the person you're going to marry. So possibly Capricorn, okay? Um, maybe a person who is a bad boy or a bad girl. Oh my goodness or like have a pretty interesting colorful past your person okay they could be a playboy a playgirl or someone who had a, some kind of interesting past okay they could also be someone who had who used to had vices alcohol smoking some kind of addiction okay so that's how i could interpret for you right now they 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 are <laughs> i do, i don't know if it's a past but they they are a b bad boy or a bad girl okay so let's see um anything else you need to know about this person yeah the hangman 
but it's in reverse. For some reason, Spirit Guy says I need to read this on reverse. So your your um, connection has already awakened. Your connection, you know, has already changed their ways. So if they were someone who is a player before or have a very interesting past, a lot of women, a lot of men um, have, you know, drinking problems, smoking problem, they're they're laying low now because this is a person who's seen the light they're trying to move away like maybe before they like to drink all night they like to party they're like party animal night life or something but now this person has grown from that or is growing away from that so in other words your connection could be someone who's already making their transformation, okay? They are trying to, like, not be a player anymore. Maybe this person is already ready to, to find the right partner, the right relationship, the right person, which is you, pile one. But we will find out how you're going to find each other, the Hierophant, because it's destiny. I'm seeing, I'm seeing, you know, the hangman could be a Pisces, and the Hierophant could be Taurus, Capricorn, Pisces, Taurus. But the Hierophant is someone who's traditional, a leader, could be a mature man, could be someone who, who is spiritual or who is religious or possibly they trying to come back to to their faith in God, but maybe this person believes in spirituality, believe in the law of the universe, or they believe in God. But they're also someone who give good advices because people gravitate to them for advice. They are trustworthy, they're very grounded, okay? Um, they're a good listener. They're a good mentor, teacher, supporter. Okay, so um, so far that's how I could say. Occupation-wise, they could be someone who like have a high position, have like um, like you know, have a higher authority. Maybe they own their business, or maybe there could be a manager, or they could be someone who's really like um, they know. They know their industry, they know their craft, okay? But this person has to go through like the lowest points in their life and then it's kind of like rags to riches story, okay? Because look, they were lost before, that, but they had to change themselves until they have to grow up. So it takes a lot of process for this person to evolve, but they already was doing their transformation. That's how I could understand. And what else can I see, sparing eyes? I feel like you also have a very long time to find this person, pile one. What was the delay? Why it took you? some time to find this person because this person has to finish off their soul contract has to change their ways from the negative karmic patterns like alcoholism temptation third party connection or being a player or bad boy and bad girl and that's the reason destiny and the universe and god up above or the divine has opened your doors to get to know each other because it is ready i mean you are both ready this is your time to meet. This is this is a destined, fated connection because it's written in the stars, written by the hand of God. Okay, it's you were meant to meet each other right now because this person who's going to marry you has changed their ways. But if they did not change their ways, their their um, you know their toxic 
old ways before i don't think you're even going to meet or even you're even going to see signs or going to get the intuition or guidance from universe that you're both ready but so far that's what i could understand okay who this person is so let's see um some of you could they could be a fair man or a dark man fair complexion darker complexion yeah five of swords this person was trapped before if it's a masculine or maybe this person you were connecting to they were trapped in a codependent or toxic relationship before or maybe they they made bad decisions before that's the reason why they had to move away from these challenges five of swords could be yeah it could be tests and challenges the hardship that they have to come to go through or it could also meant that they were surrounded by a lot of people who were toxic like karmic friends karmic family okay who were like a bad influence in their life possibly they, these were people who like they used to go out to at the nightlife or maybe these are people who works with them who's kind of like bad influence or put them in a peer pressure to like you know introduce them to the to like some kind of toxic behaviors or maybe this person let's say if they have like sex addiction alcohol or substance abuse or i don't know what the vices so anyway i'm sorry i i, I have to tell you okay i mean because i am hearing it so what else is very ace of cups there's a very strong spiritual and soul connection between you okay i'm also seeing libra gemini aquarius and pisces cancer scorpio yeah this person is seeing signs synchronicities they're very conscious or maybe they're wondering now what is the connection between you two do you already know this person i felt like you're still getting to know this person or you have already connected but this relationship still kind of like new love new romance is still waiting to blossom so if this is a new person you were very much drawn to i feel like the feeling is mutual but they still have to really act on these feelings towards you okay but it's very deep you might be really connecting on the astral or the spiritual plane the tower moment i kind of knew it it's the transformation they really had to see you they get have to get to know you they have to make the effort to break down these walls Maybe these are their walls here in the physical world. If your world, your status, or if if you were, if you and this person is kind of different from each other, they have to like not put any division between you two because the tower moments. This could mean right now that you're currently in separation, no contact, or not talking at all, or possibly being drawn towards each other like you know you're watching each other but you still have to get to know each other communicate and really help this connection to grow okay but someone is going through like like a spiritual awakening spiritual transformation there's a lot of changes that has been happening here in the background even if like right now you might be thinking like you're not seeing anything on the physical but just pain separation and the long waiting period but the divine is at work here because because what my guys is trying to tell me they are trying to help your connection like push through the changes that they need to push through if they were stuck on codependency third party connection toxic connection toxic people toxic jobs or addictions so this is what's happening here so this is this is what your person is going through right now possibility they currently going through losses in income or maybe they going through some kind of like transformation and healing in their life 
spirit guide says they're possibly just work on new projects but it's good for them okay this is really very essential for your connection so there could be actual distance between you two right now but even though if there's you're so far away from each other right now let's say it's geography or something like that but the connection is there hmm. the feeling is there king of pentacles yeah right now this person is very much focused on money and their um, stability and their success in the physical world so this person could be um, entrepreneur um, business owner a CEO someone who's wealthy someone who's generous and hard-working person so so far that's what I could understand and will this person treat you right I think so this person possibly did not experience love before in any of their relationship or maybe they thought they fell in love but they never really knew love until they're going to awaken in this connection between you two okay so this person is going to be very generous to you they're going to give you gifts um their they want to really spoil you okay so so far that's what i could understand who your person is let's see maybe your person could also be a banker good with numbers but it's more on sales business management what else is very guys? Yeah, this person possibly loves to drink wine, loves to party. And they're surrounded by a lot of people, okay? So anyway, as, uh, who else? Spirit guys, anything more that we need to know about Pile 1, the person who's going to marry Pile 1? Travel, yep. They travel a lot for work, fantasy. So this person has a wild imagination or maybe they're fantasizing about you and they really think you're white material we're kind of picking that up i know there's feeling here okay or they think you're white material or if you are a masculine anyway regardless white material husband material potential they see the potential in you so even if like let's say you need to communicate and express your feelings towards each other. They see the potential. They see themselves with you. Beautiful face. And they really think you have a very beautiful face. And there's something like a light within you. They, they see it. Why they see it? Because they have gone through their ascension. Your person, pal one. They have awakened. That's why I said lights on so this person is really going to appreciate you maybe you are someone who's kind of like low on self-confidence right now but you do not understand this person sees you loves you in perfection and really thinks you're very beautiful i feel like they also felt your energy when they look at you when they're around you they something about you that's what i could pick up straight hair okay so you might have straight hair or they could have straight hair dating so this person is really interested to get to know you and to date you because maybe you're still in the stage that you have to get to know each other but they see the potential so they're thinking and look there's something about you that's very healing to them you make them feel calm and peaceful and like maybe they didn't they didn't they weren't feeling the stability before in all of their connections or maybe there was there was no deep connections there maybe everything that they went through in a relationship or connection before maybe it was just shallow but when it comes to you it's very deep this connection between you two okay so anyway spirit guys can i have additional please 
Yeah, look, this person possibly like your sexy booty. They really like your curves. So they really, they really like your face. They really like your body. They're very sensual. They're very sexual. So what is this person going to teach? Maybe this person is going to teach you like about pleasure or something. Okay, well, secret feelings. I knew it. This person harbors a lot of fantasy and secret feelings about you. Spirit guys says, that's it. I need to stop there. And uh, let's see. Let's see additional message. Okay, maybe I'll get like one message. Who is this person who's going to marry you? Just just six of bottoms six of pentacles they're trying to clear the karma this person also reciprocate your feelings so that means they're really working hard to be with you as well the good you do comes back to you an unexpected inflow of money borrowing wisely or repaying a debt but they're like i said the, your person has already awakened and they're already paying off the karmic debt and changing from their negative karmic patterns so they are on their way to you pile one so if you're going to ask me when is this going to be it could be very soon it could be now it could be anytime soon because this person has already awakened and already clearing their karmic depth so they can be with you so let's see um what else i could understand spirit guys you are worthy i tell you they see the potential in you they see you as wife material husband material and there's pink roses here or peaches I, but i felt like it's pink roses wow your worth doesn't depend on the other person so there could be a message here that yeah maybe you were so sick of waiting for this person to come in your life but remember the pink roses here or pink could also signify self-love so even if you do not understand if someone's going to come your way someone's going to marry you i felt like you have to focus that peace and love and like the healing within yourself and before you know it your future husband future wife future spouse is going to come in your life can i get two more please spirit guys just for um natural evolution let the situation unfold naturally but i really but i really do know that this person is here it's about to come your way or possibly you already know each other i mean this is the spiritual evolution and uh, the spiritual transformation and the changes that i'm seeing this is also speaking about divine timing like when i was saying because you are both ready you are both ready to meet now you are fated and destined to meet each other now because the, the your person has already started to clear off the karmic debts because if they did not clear the karmic debts or their soul contract i don't know if universe even going to give you the green light to go at each other but right now you have the green light or the universe is giving your person the green light to come in your life i still really intuitively feel that this person going to marry you is is here is going to come okay responsibilities romance interrupted duties come first well we kind of know anyway that this person needs to be responsible for you needs to be responsible for whatever mistakes they have done in the past but now i could understand that they could be in the emperor or empress energy they cannot come your way if they're still immature and irresponsible i told you that while ago the reason why you're going to be drawn to this person or you're going to meet each other because you are both ready that's the message here this is your person so um yeah i tell you divine timing i'm not even kidding you see spirit guy says because you're both ready a serendipitous event is also meant fated and destined see i still think i'm very consistent in your pile maybe you are someone who's thinking when is this when is this going to be you've been waiting forever well i could sense now or anytime soon 
Maybe you already know your future husband. So pay attention. So thank you, pile one. That's what I could understand for you. Hope you resonate. And then we're going to learn again later. But it's interesting. I feel like the messages here are very consistent for you. So, you know, I'm thankful for my guides that they gave us the chance that we can we can channel like this. But we are in the human world, so we need to have energy. Okay, so anyway, um, let's see. Welcome, pile two. Fast forward to the timestamp. Who is this person who's going to marry you? Any details, information, anything that we need to know about this person who's going to marry you? You're now. And the present and the future okay who is this person who's going to marry you thank you page of cups could be a new love a new person coming your way could be someone who is your friend already or someone revolving around you or this person already watching you because they you could have a secret admirer this person wants to like get to know you and ask you for a date because page of cups they could be younger youthful looking or it could be a new love a new person or this could be someone you your crush or someone who has a crush on you okay so maybe you go to school you work with this person or this person discovered you somewhere passing by i don't know but I felt like this person really cannot stop thinking about you. They secretly admire you or something. And then they're wishing for something more. So this is the person who's going to marry you. I tell you, there could be distance between you because this person could be from a faraway land. But the fool is a possibility again, a, a, a potential new person, a potential new lover who has sincere intentions and very hopeful for your connection so um this is really a person who's really wanting to come in your life if there's actual distance this person really wants to travel to you or relocate or really be closer to you because hmm, maybe this person likes dogs or maybe you like pets or flowers. So I'm hearing something about solar plexus chakra. This person like thinks a lot. They have a lot of ideas, but spirit guide says they need to push through on their ideas because this person is thinking and dreaming about you and then fantasizing what they want to do. They're, these thoughts are all in their head right now, but they need to really make a move on you. That's what's happening here because they're kind of like playing so many kinds of scenario, how to, how to be closer to you, how to get to you, how to get to you. But they kind of like, I don't know, they're putting a lot of options right now, how to meet you, how to find you. But this person is really trying to find you, trying to find a way, an opening, how to come in your life. Because both energies here are very youthful, a, a new person, a new love. So... Maybe you're going to meet this person while you are going to um, like move to a new place, move to a new house or a new location, or maybe you have started a new job or you have started a new project or you started like working on yourself or something. So, because Spirit Guide says when you started to like, like you know maybe your energy wasn't so good before so now if you're going to like put your energy a little bit high vibe or really working on your high vibration so this is when you're going to meet this person because this person's trying to say 
they want to be with you they want to get to know you they want to find you okay so who else is this person king of swords so i'm seeing pisces cancer scorpio air sign libra gemini aquarius so this person is mysterious even though they could be a few years older than you or maybe they're not too old because i'm feeling i'm picking up like a youthful younger looking person or they look young for their age they could be like a noble person they could be a good communicator maybe they're into communications they they are very smart so um they have good communication skills but this person is also very guarded, okay? Because possibility, they have to really be careful with a lot of toxicity around them too. So, but I feel like this person is ready to make changes in their love life. If you're going to ask me, is this person single right now? It is very much possible because look, they're looking at you. They want to be with you. They're trying to find you. They want to change their their status as well. Because this person is in the lookout to find you. Yeah, another page. I tell you. Remember when I was channeling that this person has a lot of ideas. But they need to put these ideas into action. They were dating around before but it was nothing serious. There's a lot of pages here, so that means this person is a possibility of new love or wanting to come in your way. They could be mysterious as well. There are times that they like to be quiet. They like to read two of ones. I tell you, this person is trying to find you. Now I'm seeing Leo Aries Sagittarius here. Are they going to be attracted to you? Yes. How are they going to treat you? They want to take you to places, wonderful restaurants, wonderful places. They actually want to do things with you and go around, travel the world or take you around, okay? Because this person is adventurous, very creative. They like to do things, okay? other times they could be a little bit restless because i'm seeing a lot like this person has is really looking for themselves and also looking for you so maybe at one point in their life wherever they are maybe they connected with other connections but they realize it wasn't what they're looking for before so that's the reason why this person took the journey to find you so is this person high vibrational they're they're a work in progress okay this person knight of swords i tell you a youthful younger looking restless adventurous someone who could be a little bit maybe they like theater movie melodramatic i feel like they like shakespeare they like history documentary they like those, you know, something about like, this person is very intellectual. That's how I could understand. I need to stretch. So, um, do you know this person already? I feel like there's distance between you right now, even if you actually know each other, but there's something that's maybe it's physical distance. You know, as they say on the uh, when it comes to relationship and dating, geography, familiarity, like you have to always run into each other. You have to be close towards each other, so you're going to get exposed towards each other. But right now we're in the age of social media, so you know social media can make everything easier because anyone can find anyone so maybe you are someone who sees this person in social media or they sees you in social media but this person is really really wanting to travel to you to be close to you they have a lot to say if only you knew that this person really wants to come in your life 
So they could be on the younger side. That's all I can um, understand for now. Let's see additional energies who this person is. But Spirit Guy says they're very youthful. They could have a baby face. They could be a younger soul. They like to play. They like to have fun. They like to dance. They like to sing. This person is multi-talented. And then possibly it's part of their job to tour around the world. They could be a public figure as well. We, I mean, it is possibility because I am seeing that they're very talented, okay? They could be a stage performer, an actor, a musician, or someone who is really lucky to have a kind of job that, you know, they can, they can see beautiful things, places. But even so, they have all that. This person was always in search for true love. They're, this person's always in search for you because they, I feel like they kind of know, okay, that they don't want to be settling for less. This person has high standards, just to let you know that they're very picky, they're, they're very private, but they've done it all, or they will have it all. They have really, like, strong potential to, like, this person is a dreamer as well, okay? But they're also... I can also see that they're also a doer, okay? They just don't dream and dream and have a lot of ideas and then don't take action on it. I felt like this person thinks a lot about you, but they also want to come in and say a lot of things to you. So I hope this is going to really come true for you. This is the person who's going to marry you. Let's see, spiritual. So I was about to ask the spirit guys if this person is awakened. But I guess I, my, my guys answered my question, even if I didn't say it out loud. This person is spiritual. They are spiritually awakened. Okay, so that means they're high vibrational. And... Um, they were in search for deeper connections now. It's not just shallow, okay? Even if they're a young soul, they want, like, deeper relationship with their soulmate or their twin flame. Even if they don't know what a twin flame connection is, but they kind of, they, they know that they want to be with someone they can really connect with in all levels, spiritually, emotionally, mentally, physically. They This person just don't want to be connecting like shallow although they've been around okay but they never really stayed because if they know that there wasn't any deep connection there they they move on because they wanna look for you this person is freaky in the bedroom like i said maybe this person connected with previous relationship in the past but maybe it was just really superficial and shallow and after when like you know after all this kind of like honeymoon phase then that's it the reality hits okay life partner because like i said this person is in search for their real life partner it doesn't mean if they were they were married before divorced separated whatever they weren't you so that's the reason why this person is looking for you right now or if you were someone who had bad and toxic relationship in the past then because the because whoever you connected to in the past wasn't this person. See, I feel like I want to kiss you right now. So maybe if you are watching this person, you already know this person, watching their photos or whatever, then you might be thinking like, you really want to kiss this person right now. Okay, no panty. Okay, so <laughs> there's a message here, freaking in the bedroom and no panty. So <laughs> maybe this person is turns turns them on to like be freaky but i feel like you're going to marry each other anyway or you're going to like each other so <laughs> oh my god so okay maybe this person is going to teach you how to be freaky <laughs> but my i mean you're having fun anyway so nothing wrong with that so i want to make you mine yeah look this person is really going to be so passionate 
and hopefully so in love with you or maybe you are very much in love with this person as well so wow let's find out more well this person once they come in your life i don't think they this person ever want to let you go because they've been looking for you all their life i feel like maybe when you're going to meet each other they're going to say where have you been all my life or i have been trying to catch your attention or i've been trying to like make you see me but it's also like you know the perfect timing that's how i could understand as well but this person consciously they always know that you were out there especially if it's a very strong masculine energy they are aware that you are out there it don't matter what relationship or whatever they have went through in the past they have always known that you are out there somewhere because for some reason maybe they're they connected with others that, and they know that there wasn't it didn't develop more into something deeper that they really were looking for i will call you very soon so i hope this person is going to sweep you off your feet very soon i hope universe is going to really give you the chance the opportunity to get to know each other or to at least speak towards each other i will call you very soon air sign libra gemini aquarius oh my god yes it's an air sign we are seeing it libra gemini aquarius it's not a coincidence let's get a few more please Esperi, guys. is that even a coincidence no my guides and me there's no more coincidence healthy lifestyle so maybe this person is very conscious right now to lead a healthy life lifestyle health and wellness or maybe they're trying to really get you know they, they eat better sleep better or maybe they need to to rest more or maybe now they're very conscious that they need to lead a healthy lifestyle maybe they do live a green organic diet i don't know we will you will find out i'm not sure if they're vegan or maybe you are also thinking to live a very healthy lifestyle okay so i have never met anyone like you i kind of knew it this person has always been looking for you because like i said and i'm going to repeat again it don't matter what happened in their past because they, it was never you okay and that's why they were saying i have never met anyone like you where have you been all my life you know i am trying to channel to you real time right now <laughs> pile two so there's no such thing as coincidence so let's see four of summer is four of cups someone feeling bored and frustrated and impatient it could be you or maybe they were feeling impatient too because they're possibly frustrated why it never worked out with anyone else, no matter how much they tried, or for you as well, you were feeling bored, waiting, and what's happening here? Being distracted and failing to see a magical opportunity, taking someone or something for granted, discontentment in life, because I kind of knew that they weren't happy if they were having previous relationship, toxic connections. It don't, have, it don't matter what happened in the past or with you with you as well you're also waiting impatiently you cannot like you know you're saying to universe you can't wait to be with this person you can't wait to spend your life with this person let it be possible that's what that's what i could understand so spirit guy says you have to take care of your vibration more your healing so you can manifest this person into your life physically okay so that's what i could understand so what else this person could be medium height to tall beautiful skin smooth skin younger looking they have beautiful smile 
they have beautiful eyes they have the sexy bedroom eyes they really have very strong charisma and they're very creative and talented okay so i think i already told you that so anyway what else manifesting the one oh my god i tell you this person has always been manifesting you looking for you searching for you all their life very soon your true love will arrive exactly i'm having goosebumps <laughs> because never give up manifesting the one because very soon your true love is going to arrive maybe you're feeling very impatient because you might be thinking oh my god the universe must be putting deaf ears in your prayers but no there's something somewhere up above is always at work workplace romance common cause connection okay well anyway maybe you're going to meet this person while you are working or you actually work together or maybe you're both spiritually awakened and then you're going to stumble into the same collective same soul tribe same soul family okay so anyway maybe someone in here could be in the military law enforcement truth law legal justice i mean it kind of makes sense because maybe this person is a man or a woman of honor maybe someone had military background here or maybe they are like that they like to keep to their word they don't like to like just talk 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 with no action they are a warrior as well okay so um they're trying to be strong and courageous tease oh my god the energy is fun and light-hearted but uncertain but yeah spirit guys is trying to say this this connection is like you still in the flirting process or you still need to really get to know each other and flirt with each other okay so maybe there's like unspoken unspoken love here unspoken mutual attraction so like i said this person really wants to find you and get close to you so can i have another one please oh my god twin flame recognition you know this soul that mirrors your own i tell you this person is very much conscious that you are out there somewhere even if they couldn't understand what a real twin flame is or what but they know that they in search for a twin flame or a soulmate deep connection. So to tell you honestly, I'm having goosebumps in your pile pile too, because this person has always been looking for you or you're always been looking for this person. And until then, Spirit Guide says, very soon your true love will arrive. Okay, so I think this is what I could understand for you. Thank you very much. Wow, uh, oh my God. Sometimes when I am consistent with whatever energy I am picking up, I'm having goosebumps. But I'm happy that we get to do that. Like I said, it's not every day we're going to have the best guardians. So no matter what, we, we continue anyway. Whatever will be, will be so let's see i feel gravitated to pile yellow i don't know why i like pile yellow maybe it's the collective energy or maybe you can pick brown or purple but i'm just going to be honest that this is my personal choice maybe it's going to make it resonate in my personal life or also a very important message for our collective so let's see who is the person who's going to marry us, Perry guys? For pile yellow, please. Five of wills. Hmm. Five of wills, like someone is feeling isolated here. Maybe someone is like not in the dating market for a while. Maybe you, that's you, pile three. You have fears, you have trauma, you feeling isolated, you feeling like your love life needs to change because five of wills is, has a lot of insecurity like you've been hurt before and you're also struggling in this physical world trying to understand about your journey so possibly you are someone who is going through transitions when it comes to like job money or 
you're trying to find where you need to be because you're feeling lost scared and alone right now okay because the five of wheels five of pentacles is someone who has the fear of being alone fear of abandonment fear of intimacy so see you're kind of complicated paltry you're manifesting to be with the right person but at the same time you're also do not just want to you kind of like restrict yourself okay you put a wall you put i, I don't know there's a lot of overthinking over worrying in here but at this but if I could summarize it all, you're feeling empty, you're feeling lonely, you're you're kind of crying in the dark. And um, wow, that's kind of like insanity. King of Swords. You're manifesting someone who's going to really fight for you, going to protect you. Maybe you didn't, you, you possibly didn't know that there is someone who's really going to come in your life who's going to be there by your side good times and bad times because the king of swords is someone like mysterious serious um sincere smart like going to be like Spirit guy says they could be a teacher, a mentor, or an inspiration to you. A mature man as well, with a lot of wisdom. So anyway, I'm seeing Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Huh. I feel like this is the reason why you put yourself in this situation of seclusion, isolation, because you've been burned before, you've been ghosted, you've been hurt, you've been you've felt a lot of trauma before maybe you were a domestic violence survivor or something like that or simply be like you've you um broke up with toxic connections or you were fed up connecting with people who doesn't see your worth so you kind of took a break from the dating scene so now you are manifesting this person to come your way who is actually going to be stable for you. Who is actually like someone who can make you better, okay? And not going to pull you back into the dark. So this is what you are manifesting right now. Like you are searching for the light at the end of the tunnel when it comes to love, okay? So is there hope for you, Peltry? Who is this person going to come your way and going to marry you? Yeah, I tell you. You were in a really dark place. The death is an energy of rebirth, transportation, transportation, transformation, and a lot of changes. Okay, like I feel like it's a reset button that you have to, like, you know, like close the past, close the old chapter, and start again. Spirit guy says, don't be afraid to start again. Because right now you're trapped in your own darkness. That's why I was already channeling a lot of mental mental overthinking and you're feeling restricted. You're feeling like you want to be with somebody and then and then there's a lot of fears and wolves and stubbornness here because maybe universe trying to say embrace change and then but you were stuck. Okay. Okay, let's find out more. Because this could be dark night of the soul. This, what you went through. Or maybe this person who's going to marry you also has to undergo this reset, transformation, spiritual awakening. So you're, you can vibe together. But let's understand. Okay, so anyway, maybe this person also has to... to to go through like karmic lessons how are you going to find each other because you are here you're kind of like very secretive hiding and licking your pain okay and then um you're not really healing or maybe you were trying to heal yourself or you were doing shadow work but spirit guy says you're not going to be like trapped inside your cocoon forever if you want to search for this person who's going to marry you you have to open up 
because right now like i said you're searching for the light at the end of the tunnel let's see let's see is this person understanding is this person going to love you let's see huh. that could be scorpio energy the strength strength could be leo and there's a bear here yeah i tell you okay pal three spirit guy says you have to come out and face the rising sun you have to follow the light because you do not want to be be falling off into the same same old oblivion and abyss of loneliness okay and then be self-pity because right now i felt like you're having so much self-pity self-sabotage so strength means courageous bravery be brave have courage be kind to yourself be gentle with yourself maybe you're someone who's so angry and in pain maybe spirit guy says whoever has hurt you in the past forgive forgive let go of the past and try again just because someone has hurt you in the past doesn't mean that there's no few good people left especially like your special partner future significant other they're here okay but you need to help yourself as well because you encountered a lot of blockages but the strength i could also see that as marriage as union okay like maybe you were in search for a soulmate for let's let's see how are you going to meet this person and who is this person spirit guys three of cups you might meet this person through a party a gathering or your community maybe that's how you're going to find each other because three of cups alert around a lot of people or maybe a place where there's a lot of people could be restaurant hotel business establishment okay so or a celebration of some kind maybe you're going to meet this person during the holidays okay i don't know but let's let's see what else i'm seeing um pisces cancer scorpio huh. the star your person could be someone who is a star seed <laughs> they're not alien okay but maybe there's difference between you two or there's distance between you two maybe they live far away from you but the star means that dreams do come true maybe there's a feminine here you are different you could be an indigo star seed like worker earth angel you're kind of feeling out of place in this world right now so you are in search for someone who understands you who gets you so you are a star seed or maybe your significant other is someone who is a star seed who believes in the universe maybe they also look up to the planets and the stars or space okay hmm what does this person do let me understand temperance is also divine timing but they this person likes to keep to themselves as well when they want to work they they want to work but they like to have a peaceful relationship peaceful environment this person is not argumentative i mean i feel like Temperance is a very well-balanced person, could also be a healer. So, you know, the way I could understand, maybe one is a star seed, and then someone could also be an empath or an earth angel here. Maybe this person is going to come in your life to heal you or to help you heal because I feel like that's why I said you are an introvert, you are an old soul pile three, and you are in search for someone who understands you, who is very healing and going to give you peace and feels like 
you're going to belong you're in search for your family for that one person you're going to belong to because um let me understand more okay I, I feel like this person is very gentle to you going to be really understanding and kind and peaceful to you and very and going to give you strength okay to lift yourself up so let's see what else is there guys but temperance could also be the perfect relationship the perfect timing the right timing but it could also meant it's going to happen now okay so what else is pairing guys but this person is very noble because this king of swords keep coming on one two and three but huh, i tell you the justice the justice is also like never settling for less justice i also see this as the empress energy you are highly awakened you are spiritually awakened and you are very gifted pile three you went through rebirth and your transformation and you whatever if you're going through dark night of the soul right now you're going to come out of it anyway because you're a warrior you're a fighter but you were just feeling tired and you're feeling lost by universe trying to say never give up because justice will be served okay the justice also could signify karma like good karma bad karma or the good lessons and the bad lessons that you have to go through in your life but you're going to conquer all that because the justice could also be winning slaying all the demons and saying bye bye to all this difficult past i feel like this person who's going to marry you is going to give you justice okay this person is going to really like maybe if others do, did not believe you before then this person will this person has always believed you never be judgmental of you like i said they're very kind they're very gentle they're very loving and they're going to protect you okay but i felt like you've never you never you never see this person coming but this person has always been here possibly watching you because you were here trapped in your own darkness and thinking why no one understands you. So you crawled back into your shell and then you think like you're very angry. You're very like, you know, you were drowning in your own misery. And then you're possibly like, you know, feeling like this is it for you because you you're really going through a lot of struggles so anyway let's understand more who is this person but it's beautiful energy because this person who's going to marry you gets you okay maybe you were someone who were like you know you encountered a lot of non-believers or people who like really look down on you but then when this person this person has never looked down on you this person has seen you from the very start okay but like i said this person what they're going to bring into your life strength courage power and you help you find yourself again okay so something like that or help you find your potential so you can be your best upgraded version of yourself wow i i can't believe this where is this person now i feel like this person is like emperor energy okay like i feel like they're trying to tell you stay strong but we all go through the journey anyway but this person has always secretly they never really like judge you actually they 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 consciously know what you're going through okay whatever the insanity of a situation here so let's see um who is this person who's going to marry you pile three i'm sorry for all the things i did <laughs> i don't know if there's any love and hate here but there this person is realizing like maybe someone wants to say i'm sorry for all the things i did what is this did this person troll you before <laughs> or ghosted you or like you know i don't know but i kind of picking up there was like love and hate here 
<laughs> maybe this person was mad at you for not looking at them before that's why they were like kind of like upset with you but you didn't see them it wasn't i don't know what happened in this i want to love you forever oh my god well maybe that's the reason why because this person like you to see them because they want to tell you that they want to love you forever why are you like looking around not seeing them when they're just there they're right in front of you you, you never even see them so anyway i don't know why i'm picking that up <laughs> but there's a message here i'm sorry for all the things i did but if really someone has really done you wrong spirit guy says forgive okay you have to like pick up yourself and try again okay never focus on who did you wrong or who did not believe you you focus on whatever this beautiful journey has to offer and if your search is happiness your significant other and your true love and so it is okay be happy and that's the best revenge of all okay you're not going to be seeking validation for others that yeah whatever let universe lead you to wonderful things and that's you know to be happy and you're not even going to be thinking who hurt you and who did not believe you in the past okay so anyway um what else is very nice distance there could actually be distance between you two i was seeing it with the stars it could be geography maybe this person travels a lot for work springtime maybe this person has seen you in springtime or maybe in you're going to have a spring wedding i don't know but some, there's a season here of spring maybe you're going to meet in spring or you're going to see each other again i don't know but this person i feel like are they close to you spirit guy says this person has never left you i feel like this person's with you spiritually like every day is with you no matter what distance space and time it's always there okay they know they could have curly hair wavy hair double degree education very smart i kind of knew it they're very very smart even if they don't have double degree education but they could be really like high level okay high level thinker fast learner they could have dark or olive skin it's a possibility okay sexual magnet oh my god it could be really charming and magnetic but maybe they are thinking you're also the sexual magnet so they're very very attracted to you as well or maybe this person is very attractive you make my heart beat fast this person is possibly possibly you make them nervous or you get nervous when you are with this person but you never see this person anyway i felt like but i felt like this person is the one looking at you you were in the five of pentacles and he is the, and, and then your person is in the king of swords so your person is much more aware of you than you were aware of them so but you make this person's you awaken something with them passion feelings emotions i feel like you also kind of trigger this person to awaken that's why huh so it's interesting so it's very guys what else who is this person i miss you yeah this person says they miss you i miss you you want to be physically together right now you want to be in union okay so you could be in separation right now so what else happily ever after i feel like this person do not want to let you go this person is trying to say i miss you i do not want to be separated from you let's what do you want pile three do you want your happily ever after so i guess this person is willing to give you that his place <laughs> oh my goodness so anyway, maybe this person wants to invite you to his place. Or maybe you're going to relocate in his area. I don't know. 
say I do. I tell you, there's happily ever after and the say I do. Maybe this person has always been searching for the one that he can be with, to marry with. I'm not saying this person doesn't have a relationship in the past, but I feel like with you, this person sees himself with you. This person sees you as their future wife, their future husband. But there's really a very strong masculine here. They have never left you. They've been aware of you from the very start. Scar. And they possibly like think that, you know, you were hurt. You have scars. You have imperfection. But does this person care? I feel like this person wanted your attention from the very start, pile three. Okay. So let's see. I <laughs> I wanted to get a few more because this interesting energy is here that I am seeing. So, okay, there's a lot more that came. So, you brought so much joy in my life. If this person is aware of you and never left you every day, you bring joy into the... I am obsessed with you. I think about you every day. See, I tell you, this person has never left you been thinking about you obsessed with you that's the reason why i have to get more because i need very romantic you really awaken maybe they're always been romantic but you make them think about love or romantic i like everything about you even your scars even your imperfections even your feistiness i understand how you feel because that's exactly what i was already trying to say this person no matter what happened even if they did you wrong or something like a misunderstanding, this person has always understood, understand you. You make me feel so much. Sometimes I get so scared to tell you how I feel. But this person wants to be with you anyway. That's like, that's not even a question. This person has never left you, always been obsessed with you. But what else can I understand? I just needed to pull more because... I needed to understand who is this person coming your way but I feel like if you resonate well I don't think this person is going anywhere because their eyes are on you they're watching you right now I mean they are in the king of swords energy so I feel like they're watching you like a, a hawk an eagle they have surveillance okay so what else tree of winter ah there's another bear in here and someone again in the lost heartache energy reach out to others for comfort and love you will grow stronger from this situation sadness that will heal with time but you were in the five of pentacles energy and this is exactly how you are feeling feeling lonely empty feeling sad you were so trapped in your own misery and sadness that you can even see this person looking at you so let's understand okay tree of winter maybe you were involved with like a lot of toxic connections before and you were involved with toxic people and you thought those connections were for you but obviously there was heartache here maybe this person knew that you are feeling the scars you are healing yourself right now but this person is going to help you heal. That's why I said justice will be served because this person is going to bring strength, power, healing, and love into your life. King of Summer, Pisces, Cancer. Uh, King of Summer is, uh, I think it's King of Pentacles. They're very wealthy. Or, well, hold on. Honorable, devoted, mature, warm-hearted. Hmm. Who is the... No, a king of summer's king of cups, right? Honorable, devoted, mature, warm-hearted. It's king of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But anyway, a romantic partner you can trust. Excellent advice that comes from the heart. Getting involved in a cultural or creative endeavor. Yeah. Regardless, the spirit guide says, look, there's a king of swords here. They're very honorable. They're going to be very protective of you. 
when you get to know each other they're going to treat you really warm and gentle they're very understanding a person you can trust a person who's going to understand you the person is going to listen to you a person is going to light your way even if you are feeling like confused and in a very dark place this person has always been here okay i think this king of summer is king of cups but i am curious now what is the king of what is the pen yeah the the king of summer is the king of cups because look this is the ace of cups right here there's a very strong spiritual connection between you two open your heart to love the beginning of a new intimate relationship or a rebirth of a current one you've already had past life relationship with this person this could be a new love or a new person or someone you might already know but still you know this this romance is still and a work in progress the awakening of psychic abilities or spiritual epiphanies you're both spiritually conscious maybe you belong in the same collective but we are all in the same collective anyway that's the reason why you found me here okay i'm just your captain and commander kind of like navigating here but we already know that i'm kind of curious what is yeah spirit guy says look this person is willing to give you commitment a true love that is long lasting this person wants you to see them wants you to choose them i feel like this person has chose you from the very start it's fated and destined true love that is long lasting choices made from the heart a return to good health because this is what this person is going to bring into your life to restore your faith back in love okay to restore your faith back in humanity if you were someone who, who was feeling a lot of pain and anger okay like i said this person wants to heal you give you what you need and mostly the love and commitment companionship and the understanding that you truly need in this journey and you are also very much connected strong telepathy strong spiritual connection so anyway i'm just curious okay because i just want to see what is the pentacles energy here oh the pentacles is autumn okay so but there's a lot of water energy here this person has a lot of understanding emotions and love for you this person's love for you is very very deep i feel like this person has been carrying feelings and emotions for you for a very long time okay that's how i could understand i can only interpret or maybe you're the one who, who but anyway you are in this five of pentacles and three of swords energy so you were too busy in your own shadows and in your own darkness like licking your wounds there but this person has always been the king around you king of swords king of cups okay possibly like almost emperor energy or your emperor is here okay you've always been a king wealthy abundant successful smart loving generous okay so their energy never slap they're always in the king energy spirit soul path i tell you this is your soul mate twin flame soul collective soul family you belong in the same soul family soul collective a personal evolution within your relationship so see this person has watched you grow this person has watched your journey so if you are someone who's very intuitive have your own platform you'll never know maybe this is the reason why this person has seen your work has seen your gifts has seen you grow this person knew everything and that's the reason why you are here feeling lost scared lonely alone feeling empty but this person has always been here like i said do not underestimate our collective because no matter how much little but universe will bring us all here after all we are a uh, like a collective of supernatural and mystical and there's no coincidence there's no coincidence here so so see both of you are going through your spiritual awakening spiritual ascension maybe someone in here 
lighten their hair, color their hair, but there's a masculine here. They could have a uh, wavy, darker, medium brown hair okay so whatever the deal is i really think you care for each other you get each other so anyway uh, what else is very guys let go of the past this is what the person is going to help you to close the old chapter to forgive those who has hurt you i know it what this person going to bring into your life? Who this person? Who is this person going to marry you? Is going to give you strength and healing and peace, clear energy to allow more love in your life, and going to bring you love and energy, and going to heal you from whatever is holding you back. So you can grow, you can evolve, and no one is going to stop you now. Because I felt like the past, this all this pain that you were drowning into the heartache the misery the insecurity the anxiety it was draining and zapping your energy okay that's why wow this person is going to marry you going to help you heal the past and going to bring love energy into your life and help you going to evolve help you going to understand this spiritual soul path okay so anyway maybe you're both in the same path that's the reason why you are here right now maybe this person is going to help you to to take the right path if you were feeling lost so it feels like this person is going to give you direction going to navigate where you need to be so what else is very guys thank you so much <laughs> This person is has a burning desire and very attracted to you. Flames of passion ignite. Well, very strong attraction. Look, possibly this person is very sexual or maybe this person really wants you, really, really wants to be with you. Okay, so what else? Manifesting the one. Oh my God. I felt like this person already knows from the very start that you are the one they want to be with very soon your true love will arrive i mean seriously i know we saw this too a pile too but manifesting the one this person has always been manifesting you in their life or if you were someone manifesting the one maybe you did not see this connection coming but this person has a lot of feelings emotions and a lot of hope okay that you'll see see them that, but this person to tell you honestly this person has a lot to offer love strength courage and healing and power and going to like give you the justice that you need so i feel like <laughs> you are each other's perfect match i tell you sparing guys says that's it this is a love story written in the stars whatever <laughs> file three you complete each other in the most harmonious way there you go perfect match you are i could also say that you really were divinely guided to be together maybe you just have to really go through some kind of lessons along the way but at the end of the day spirit guy says you are each other's perfect match and you complement each other, whatever the difference is, but you complement each other, this person is really going to make you better, make you feel better, give you happiness, give you what you need, okay? So anyway, but I really think you want healing, you want strength, you want someone to believe you. You want someone to understand you. And I feel like this person, oh my God, I'm feeling breathless right now. Who is this person? Pile three. I mean, I feel gravitated to pile three. But who is this person, Spirit Guides? Because Spirit Guides says, this person has always been here. So now we gotta like put the puzzle together, my soul child. But this person has a lot of a lot to offer you okay so thank you so much you are watching 
my channel spiritual explorer 1111 so far this is the energy that i could um understand for you pile three who is the person who's going to marry you this person has always been attracted to you really really wants you possibility knew you for a very long time but just really wanting the chance for you to to see them or the opportunity that you know destiny is going to bring your paths together but i feel like there's a message here spirit soul path so maybe this person is praying or finding the right time the right moment okay how your paths going to come close together but i still think this person is a take action person this person has strong feelings for you anyway so anyway we will see who this person is but regardless i love you guys okay and you have a happy sunday bye for now